This looks ominous. Dun dun dun. Let's do this. Hope everybody's ready for talkie. This is happening. It's been a while, boy. You've done well to sneak into my fortress and wriggle your way all the way up here. I suppose the least I can do is commend you for your reckless courage. My name is Ganondorf. Dun. Bum, bum, bum. And I seriously need to fart right now. And I am the master of the Forsaken Fortress. Ah. Ah. <laughs> By the way, boy, when you drew that sword of yours out of its pedestal, did you by chance notice how all of the monsters frozen in time down there suddenly began stirring again? Do you understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you do. Foolish child, while that sword is indeed the blade of evil's bane, at the same time it has along played another role. You see, it is also a sort of key, a most wretched little key, that has kept the seal on me and my magic intact. By withdrawing the blade, you have broken that seal. Ooh. So, we gave him a power boost. And... Smack down. Didn't work. <laughs> Child abuse! Child abuse! Sorry. You cannot defeat me with a blade that does not sparkle with- Ah, oh, damn it, sparkle? <laughs> I forgot that wording. With the power to repel evil, what you hold is useless. Now only if you had some Elmer's glitter glue you could fix that. Go back to the world below, and tell that to the pathetic fools who made this blade. Its power is gone, and its edges are dull. Hi. Child abuse! Child abuse! Oh, sorry. Link, get up! Uh, stop! Let... let me go! You pathetic little sea rat! Wait, what? <gasps> huh? My Triforce power is resonating! <laughs> At long last, I found you! Princess Zelda! Say what? Well, what are you talking about? I don't know any Zelda. Fading ignorance will gain you nothing. Tell me, if you are not Zelda, then why do you have this fragment of the Triforce? What fragment? Right now, you're the only one that has one. Huh? Well, that was plot convenient. The eagles! Not quite, but the <laughs> It might as well be. The eagles! Mr. Frodo! I can't carry that burden for you, but I can carry you! Oh, oh, oh! I am blue. My butt hurts. But hey, I'm gonna take it out on you. Burn, Gunnan. What? We just burned Ganon alive. He did. This is not a kid's game. <laughs> you know, for kids. <laughs> you know, for kids. All right, so we we had a couple of revelations here. Uh, we have problems. So we saved our sister. Game over, right? Oh, hi, Valu. <laughs> 
Yeah, we did save our sister, so it is game over. How, how did you? How, what did you think of the game? Yeah, nice game. A little too much water. Though. It's all right, Link. She has merely lost consciousness. Your sister has escaped a forsaken fortress with the pirates. You relax. She's safe now. Ah, <laughs> uh, that would be you, yeah. Alex. Lord Valu, you've arrived not a moment too soon. We are deeply grateful. Watch your language, Valu. We have children present. I know your butt hurts, but we can't handle that right now. There you go. I am aware of this. Yet I thought our first priority should be to separate these two from Ganon's grasp. Again, watch your language. I was only trying to think on the fly. <laughs> Somebody actually did ask, like, when the ancient dialect comes up, we just, we curse all over the place. <laughs> it's like, no. But I did actually think of, like, doing, like, a Totoro or a Pikachu. Because that's for all the good it's going to do. That's all we know that they're saying. Link, I will explain things later. Now we must return to the world beneath the sea. Okay, so here we go. Into the light. <gasps> ow. Oh, ow. Link. You're all right. Wait, is this place? I what think that would be, what place? is this place, but okay. okay. Well, hey, and Ganondorf, what happened to him? Hey. Blake, what are you doing? <laughs> Why don't you just turn your head around? I, I get the whole concept of she can't know that the boat can actually talk, but... <laughs> She's already in a world she didn't expect she'd be in. I don't think a, a talking head boat is going to have a problem here. You must come now to the room where you got the Master Sword. Who is using that stone? I think that's more of an internal thought. Who's using oh. that stone? Just who oh, are you? Oh, just who are you? <laughs> oh, you no, oh, it yeah. is her. Link, let's see. Link and I are the only ones who can speak through this stone. How dare you use what's not yours? That would be you again, Alex. Your name is Tetra, correct? You must come with Link to see me at once. Hmm. Well, don't you sound important. Fine, we're on our way. Just hold your horses, whoever you are. Link, what are you waiting for? You heard the stone. You're supposed to show me how to get to, to where the voice is. Why are everybody making orders of me right now? Gosh! I feel like I'm the evil prince. Okay, so we need to go back down to where the uh, Master Sword was hidden. And I hope everybody's ready for even more of an expedi exposition dump because we're about to have it. Okay, what's what's going on down here? Oh, who are you? Are you him? Are you the one who was speaking through my stone without permission? Without my permission? Answer me. That stone is an enhanced version of the gossip stones long spoken of in legends of the Hyrule royal family. I am the one who made it. You made it? The royal family's gossip stone? I'm sorry, but I have no idea what you're talking about. Have neither of you heard the tales? Tales of the kingdom spoken of in the legends of the great hero. The place where the power of the gods lies hidden. This place where the two of you now stand is that kingdom. This is Hyrule. Wait, what? Dun, and that's dun, a beard right dun, there. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> and I am its king, Daphnis Nohanus Hyrule. 
Oh, Hansen. Link, don't you recognize my voice? Wait, what? <laughs> Indeed, I am the one who guided you here. I am Kane of Red Lion. Well, now that we can have this reveal, thanks, mm -hmm. Andrea. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's the castle theme from yeah, Links exactly. of the Past. Nice. And actually, if you go up to the, the floor mm -hmm. now, it actually does a rendition of the Temple of Time. Nice. There was no need for me to reveal my true identity to you. So long as the blade, the Master Sword, could defeat Ganon. But now, both of you must listen to me. Yeah, that's not his beard, by the way, everybody. It's a really weird looking collar. Yeah, yeah why did you say it was a beard? Because it looks like that from the angle. <laughs> so I was like, holy beard, Batman! Once long ago, this land of Hyrule was turned into a world of shadows by Ganon, who sought to attain the power of gods for his own evil ends. My power alone could not stop the fiend and our only choice was to leave the fate of the kingdom in the hands of the gods. When the gods heard our pleas, they chose to seal away not only Ganon, but Hyrule itself. So, with a torrential downpour of rains from the heavens, our fair kingdom was soon buried beneath the waves, forgotten at the bottom of the ocean. Yet, all was not lost, for the gods knew to seal people away with the kingdom would be would to be grant Ganon's wish for the destruction of the land. So before sealing of the kingdom, the gods chose those who would build a new country and command them to take refuge on the mountain tops. Those people were your ancestors. <gasps> so you literally just told people to wait on mountain tops. <coughs> Yeah, that strangely works. Hundreds of years have passed since then. So long as Ganondorf was not revived, thy rule would remain below, never waking from its slumber. Tetra, come to me. Come to my head. <laughs> come. No, no, no. <laughs> Don't do the come to butt head. This necklace you wear is part of the sacred treasure called the Triforce of Wisdom, which has been passed down for many ages within the royal family of Hyrule. Your mother passed this down to you and instructed you to treasure it and to guard it with your life. Am I not correct? The Triforce of Wisdom is not other than the sacred power of the gods, that we've kept from Ganon's clutches so many long years. The gods placed upon your ancestors the task of protecting it from evil's grasp. You too must abide by the laws of the past, and so time has come for me to teach you the fate into which you were born, the very reason that you live. Hey, that's my pendant. <sighs> Link to the past. Yeah, this is the opening thing to Link to the, Link to the past. Yeah, I can so tell. There you go. Tons of nostalgia here. And oh my gosh, she's a girl. <laughs> well, of course she's a girl. I didn't think she was a girl. Wow, she really is Zelda. She is? Okay, Andrea, you need to change the tone a little bit. She's not as sarcastic anymore. I know that. <laughs> this is like an awakening, so... My fate. Fuck your father. <laughs> <laughs> you are the true... Dude, she totally took off her bra! <laughs> <laughs> you are the true heir of the royal family of Hyrule. The last link in the bloodline. Hit hey, Link. You are Princess Zelda. But with even more improved skirt mechanics. Zelda? I'm Princess Zelda? I'm a princess? <laughs> you are confused, aren't you? I suppose such is to be expected. But just remember, you are not a Disney princess, and therefore, <laughs> there is a hierarchy to these things. Link, 
Sloop. I am terribly sorry that you have been caught up in these events. But now that it is known that Tetra is indeed Princess Zelda. I think that's... Oh, this is weird. I don't yes. know. It's really hard to tell. Ganon will be searching frantically for this child and attempt to get the power of the gods that she possesses. He will not rest until he has found her. If he succeeds, my ancient kingdom under the sea doo -doo 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 -doo, will be turned into a land of shadow and despair. And so will the world you know above the ways. A seeding crab and a flounder will also be a part of it. <laughs> And eventually, a little kid will come around with a keyblade. Right. Link, I need you to lend me your strength in this dark hour. Got my man face on! <laughs> I have suspicion about what has caused the Master Sword to lose its power. Yeah, about that. I need you to come with me back to the lands above the water and return to the power, return the power to repel evil to the Master Sword. Zelda. Gosh, I didn't even realize this. In HD, they gave her lipstick. Really? <laughs> yeah, there's a little bit of a lipstick imprint on the model now. It is far too dangerous for you to join us in this task. Fortunately, the sacred chamber is not yet known to Ganon. It is my wish that you wait here in hiding until we return. Oh, uh, yeah, there's a bit Link, of a... Link, we uh, must that's, go. That's actually him. Oh. Link, we must go. But don't leave me behind. Okay, I have to make the joke. She's pink. Lots of pink. <sighs> See, I'm so awesome. I don't even have to climb stairs. Oh. I just teleport. Link? I don't know what to say. I don't know how to say this. But I love you. <laughs> Every Silly, this is a Zelda game. That doesn't happen. <laughs> Everything that's happened to you and your poor sister, it's all been my fault. Yeah, it kind of has. I'm so sorry. Kiss! Oh, silly. That doesn't happen in a Link. Zelda game either. <laughs> Link. Slurp. Be careful. Yeah, you can kind of see there's like a personality change now. Mm. Oh, damn it. I didn't want it to close. Uh, I wanted to showcase the room. I think it it just doesn't. Yeah, I wanted to showcase the room because I don't know if people actually notice this. There are actually, so you got to see the stained glass window of Ganon in there, but there actually are stained glass windows of every single sage from Ocarina of Time in there, too. So you actually got Raru, Darunia, Saria, Ruto. All of them got their own stained glass windows in that room, too. Hopefully, when we go back there, we'll, I'll be able to showcase it. But, yeah, this is this basically is an area full of nostalgia for a lot of people. So now we are actually set on our new quest. Because... <clears throat> bring people up to speed. Because of everything the Master Sword has been containing... It is drained. It doesn't have the power to repel evil uh, to repel evil anymore. So we, in, in turn, now must go on a quest to recharge it. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's talk to King of Red Lions, or Lick, the king. Listen well. The fact that the Master Sword lost the power to repel evil suggests to me that something has happened to the sages who infused the blade with God's power. The sages should be here in Hyrule, in the Wind Temple to the north, the Earth Temple to the south, praying to the gods. You must head for these two temples to see what has happened to the sages, and attempt to find a way to recover the power to repel evil. Unfortunately, Ganon seems to have erected some sort of magical barrier down here in Hyrule, blocking our path to the temples. But each temple should have another entrance high upon Hyrule's mountaintops, which are now islands above the sea. We used to call them flues for a chimney, but, you know, now they're doors. As always, I shall mark these places on your sea chart. 
Now then, if we stay here much longer, we shall draw our enemy's attention to Princess Zelda's whereabouts. We must return to the surface immediately. Okay, so now that we we know this, it's time for us to go into the Column of Light once again. And that's our next task now. We are going to be powering up the Master Sword to its original state before all of this happened. I'm also going to point this uh, little aspect out. The Ganondorf that you met in there, he is the Ganondorf from Ocarina of Time. He is the one that was sealed long, long ago. So this is this is big nostalgia fest. Link, do you know the legend of the Hero of Time? Once, long ago, he defeated Ganon and brought peace to the Kingdom of Hyrule. Yeah, I'm wearing his stupid tunic. A piece of the Triforce was given to the Hero of Time, and he kept it safe, much as Zelda kept hers. That sacred piece is known as the Triforce of Courage. And this actually starts you on that journey, too. When the Hero of Time was called to embark on another journey, and left the land of Hyrule, he was separated from the elements that made him a hero. He said that the Time Triforce of Courage was split into eight shards and hidden throughout the land. Even I do not know where they rest, but as much as I do know, they lie hidden, somewhere in the Great Sea. Might you have crossed paths with someone who knows much about things that lie hidden in the depths of the sea? Well, fret not. If you can think of no one, though, maybe you come up upon the knowledge of asking around in a place where many people gather. So basically he's just saying, oh, well, if you don't know how to do this, then... Go talk to people. Then go to Woodfall Island and talk to people and see if you can get that answer. But before we wrap things up, because we are actually running out of time today, we have one other thing to take care of. And that is something that we should have done probably at the beginning while we were hunting around, but we didn't do it. So... Alex is not going to like this, but I am going to be putting myself in harm's way. <laughs> it's not the whole game, putting yourself in harm's way. No, and this side, this one I'm intentionally putting myself in harm's way. So, uh, oh wait, actually, that's, that's not it. We need a bigger one. Uh, You're looking for the bigger cyclone? Yeah. Go west, young lake. Oh, I know what you're probably doing. Yep. Go west to We're Hollywood. actually going to go and get another two or another melody for the Wind Waker. Uh, but in order to do that, we now actually need to confront these uh, tidal hurricanes that we've been seeing. And you know what he's talking about, Alex? No, here. not in the slightest, but I'll see. Well, we actually now have a weapon to be able to counter it. But you'll see in a second. So, oh, look, it's a bomb boat. We don't care about you stinking bomb boats. Maybe you should apply your the item of choice while you're heading that way. It's already there. Oh, oh. hi, Mr. Rocker. It is? Yes. Oh, yeah, okay. <clears throat> Just want to make sure. Oh, your backseat driving is what you're doing. Oh my gosh. So yeah, we've had a couple of revelations. Uh, we are up against the Ganondorf from Ocarina of Time. Uh, he's pissed. Uh, Tetra Zelda. We now know who the King of Red Lions is, but that kind of got spoiled early on, Andrea. I didn't spoil it. <laughs> Alex did. Yeah. No, you did by confirming it. No, Alex did. I, I did. Andrea didn't no, do you, it. you actually said... Is it the king? And she said, uh, and she confirmed it for you. I don't recall. No, that. but he, he, he was like, I kind of knew it all along. I did. Uh, did you miss that? Because I heard it mentioned in Game Grumps. Well, you knew that he was the king of Red Lions. And now you know that he is the king of Red Lions. As well, well, I knew he was also the king of Hyrule. Because I heard it in Game Grumps. Yeah, so he kind of knew. I thought you said you hadn't watched The Wind Waker. Not The Wind Waker. I just, Dan I think it was Danny mentioned it in a, in a different Zelda playthrough. It's possible. Yeah, I've been holding off on watching Grumps play through Wind Waker. So I had to get my Zelda fix elsewhere. I have to watch their other game. Yeah, go play Breath of the Wild. <laughs> no, I mean, I've been watching other game Grumps Zelda playthroughs. 
as I watched Link to the Past again and Zelda 2 again.